Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Vijay Gidpuri, and in this video, I'll explain you how to install kubectl on Ubuntu ECT instance. So here you can see this is my AWS management console. So first we need to navigate to EC2, and here let's select instances. So directly select here launch instance. So first we need to specify the name of the instance. So here I'm giving the name like kubectl. And here, AMI type, I'm going to select Ubuntu. And instance type, T2 micro is enough. So, here I will provide TP. And when it comes to networking settings, here we need to provide VPC. And here we need to provide subnet. And here we need to provide security group. So, here I'm going with 8 GB default. So, here I'm going to select directly launch instance. Let's select here instances and let's reload this. So here you can see right now our instance is in pending state. So here we need to say active state. So here you can see our instance is in running state. So let's connect to this instance directly copy public IP for address and here I am using mobile XTEM here you can use mobile XTEM put here it may be anything question so here we need to paste public IP for address and here we need to provide Ubuntu and here we need to provide the path of the key pair so this is the key I have given so directly I will open this and ok So here you can see it was connected. So first we need to update our instance by using sudo apt update hyphen y. So when you create any of the instance, first you need to update that instance guys. So let's come to root user for hitting sudo hyphen y. So here you can see right now we are in uh, root user. So here you can see root. So let's install kubectl on this Ubuntu EC2 instance. So let's come to official documentations. So I will open a new tab and here I will search for install kubectl on Ubuntu. So here I will open this first link. I will come down. So here you can see install kubectl binary with kernel on Linux. So here you need to copy this uh, command. So first let's copy this command. Let's come to mobile system and let's paste it in here. And again, we need to go to official documentations and come down. So, here you can see download the kubectl checksum file. So, here you need to copy this. So, this is the second step, guys. So, let's come here and let's paste it here. And okay. And again let's go to official documentations so now let's validate this check some file let's copy this let's come here and let's paste it here so here you can see kubectl it was displaying ok so now we need to install uh, kubectl so directly again go here and here you can see install kubectl so directly copy this directly copy this and come here and paste it here So now, kubectl version hyphen hyphen client. So here you can see kubectl installation has been completed. So this is how you can install kubectl on Ubuntu EC2 instance, guys. So here you can see kubectl version hyphen hyphen client. You can display kubectl version, or else uh, you can directly copy this. It will display in YAML format. I'll copy this and I'll paste it here. So here you can see. This is how it will display. And yes, in this video, I explain you how to install kubectl on Ubuntu EC2 instance. And in next video, I will explain you how to create EKS cluster and connect to that cluster manually. And yes guys, that's it for today's video. And if you like my video, please do like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel guys. And see you in the next video and bye.